Today we are doing a full body pregnancy strength workout with dumbbells. I'm gonna be using five and 10 pound dumbbells, but use weight that feels safe and comfortable for you. You can also use filled up water bottles, cans of beans, or a filled up backpack. To protect your core from diastasis recti, you wanna coordinate your movement with your breath. So every time you are lifting, you wanna exhale and pull your baby in, just like my friend Liv here. Also, if you're enjoying these workouts, don't forget to subscribe and share with another pregnant friend. Let's start with a warm up. We can start circling our ankle. Going the other way. Now let's circle our hip. Exhale as you lift your knee. Good, switching to ankle circles on the other side. Nice big range of motion. Going both ways. And we'll circle our hip. Last one here. Good, we can take a staggered stance, flexing our front foot. We're gonna sweep down, coming up, and then circle our arms behind. Last one. We can switch to the other side. Slight bend in your supporting leg. One more. Good, let's lunge side to side. We can bring our feet closer together. We'll take a mini squat down. Exhale as you come up. Let's do one more and then we'll move into hamstring curls. Good. Good, I'm gonna go ahead and grab one of my 10 pound dumbbells. We're gonna squat down, exhale, pull your baby in as you press up. Set up on the other side.
I'm gonna go ahead and grab my second dumbbell. Setting up in a static lunge position. We can curl as we go down. Same movement, just on the other side. Keeping your core strong, your baby pulled in. Let's take it nice and wide for sumo squat with a triple pulse. If you wanted to add a pelvic floor contraction, you can. Triple pulse. Squeezing your quads and glutes at the top. We're gonna put down one weight after this. We're gonna lunge, exhale, knee up. Just holding the weight. Get ready for the other side. Amazing, let's go ahead and grab our second dumbbell again. Always using your legs, not your back. We're gonna sumo squat again, wide bicep curl with control.
ensuring you have a lengthened spine here and you're not rounding out at all. We're gonna pull the weights back towards our hips. Really retracting your shoulder blades. <sighs> Amazing, let's grab a sip of water. Let's set up for tricep dips. You can also do this on the edge of a chair or couch. Elbows pointing back, dipping down. Two more. Release, let's shake it out. I'm gonna grab one light dumbbell and we can make our weight down into a side plank position. You can keep your knee down if that feels safer. And we're going to hip dip and press up. Last one. Good, we can release all the way down on our side now. Let's take our top leg over and lengthen out our bottom leg. Option to add your dumbbell for a little bit of extra challenge. We can lift it up and let's pulse here. Working our adductors. Good, and lift and hold. Fully release. You can flip over to the other side. Lining up your shoulder, elbow, hips, and knees. We'll dip down, press, good. Two more. Good, releasing all the way down. Top leg can come over, flexing your bottom foot, lifting, 
pulsing. Good, lift and hold. Amazing, release down. Using your arm to push back up to a seated position. I'm gonna move that out of the way. Coming on to my glutes. And give yourself a little bit of a boost. And let's stretch side to side. Good, let's bring our feet together. Opening up through your hips, relaxing through your pelvic floor. We can sit tall and slightly hinge forward. Letting all your tension go. Coming up. Let's move into a kneeling lunge position. If you wanted to fold up your mat or get a little blanket right under your knee, you can. Taking one leg forward, tucking your tailbone under. Pressing your back knee into the ground and slightly forward not stretching too deeply. Let's come back up to kneeling, switch to the other side. Keeping your legs active. into your front foot, shift back. You can come back to a seated position. You did an amazing job today. Working out when you're pregnant is not easy, so I hope you are genuinely feeling so proud of yourself. I also have a pregnancy meal plan that I put together as a registered dietitian and my complete guide on how to reduce and cope with pain during labor. I will link to those in the description box below. I hope you have an amazing rest of your day and thank you so much for joining me.